Happy Tuesday, guys. Bill McMillan here with NDWX.com 7.30 Tuesday morning, and we've got a dry frontal boundary slipping through central Indiana. That'll help to reinforce the chill as we move through the midweek stretch, but it's uh, coming through dry, not expecting any sort of rain, and in fact, a good deal of sunshine expected today as well. We will notice at times a gusty wind. Uh, this is around 8, 9 o'clock where winds may gust uh, between 20 and 25 miles per hour or so. Gusty conditions continue into the evening hours and tonight as well, just kind of helping to reinforce the uh, cool pattern that we're in. As mentioned, it's a dry pattern, though. High pressure returns as we move through Wednesday and Thursday. Our next chance and our best chance of rain really through the upcoming period will come over the weekend. And I think still as we move into uh, Sunday into early Monday, that'll stand to be the, the best chance of seeing more widespread light rain, uh, kind of that chilly, raw feel to the air as we wrap up the weekend and open up the new work week. In general, not expecting heavy rainfall totals whatsoever. Uh, a tenth to a quarter inch of rain expected for most of central Indiana, and most of that falls again Sunday into Monday. Speaking of rain, we've got some changes uh, with the overall pattern as we move into early November. Uh, the relaxation is expected of the anonymous uh, just chill that we've been seeing over the past uh, couple of weeks really now. With that, though, we're not talking about any sort of significant you know, major warm-up, but the bigger story is um, a wetter pattern, a more active pattern developing with this pattern as we move through the first week to 10 days of November should finally allow us to, to get back into a situation where we start tracking you know, two or three uh, more significant storm systems during that first week to 10 days of the month. And the GFS ensemble is keying in on this wetter pattern across the Midwest and Ohio Valley as well. So confidence continues to increase as we move through the first week to 10 days of November for a better chance of more substantial rainfall returning. Guys, in the meantime, make it a great Tuesday, and we'll talk with you soon on NDWX.com.